This is iTrist TV, I'm Valerie Fushinsky and today we will talk about indoor cycling bikes. Recently, Mad Dog Athletics, company that developing stationary cycling equipment from the middle of 90s, filed patent infringement suit against Peloton Interactive. Patent third returned 63 patents and applications filed by Mad Dog Athletics. Peloton has 35 patents and applications. However, Mad Dog complained about infringement of only two patents of programmed exercise bicycle. What is going on here? We will try to discover it from the patents. Mad Dog's invention is stationary bike along with display that provides instruction to lead a rider through an exercise program. Rider can participate in live group class, but if it is impossible, he or she can use recorded class by replaying it on the bike's display. Computer connected to internet, allowing user to select different rides, change resistance and calculates energy spent during the ride, based on time, position of the user and resistance set on the stationary bike. Special sensors installed on the bike bars or on the separate wearable devices can catch and display heartbeat of the rider, enabling optimization by decreasing or increasing of speed during exercising. Peloton broadcasts from its studio from 10 to 14 live classes every day and it makes more than 90 each week. These rides are similar to live classes, and Peloton Library has thousands of cycling classes, consisting of 11 different types of difficultness. Each class can last from 5 to 90 minutes. Usually, the ride is from 30 to 45 minutes and provides to users immersive rides along the seaside, countryside, or even city streets. Display is equipped by camera and microphone, allowing video chats between the peloton riders. By the way, the access to the classes requires monthly subscription. It allows both streaming of the riding classes and streaming of other fitness exercises. During live classes, the app demonstrates list of the participants and interactive leaderboard and also output in watts during the exercises. In April 2020, more than 23,000 riders participated in one of the classes. And it is not surprising for me because Peloton Head Instructor has more than 540,000 of Instagram followers. And Peloton Interactive is leader of the new trend, also known as Connected Fitness. In his or her profile, the user can see all rights and achievements. And most importantly, all activity is integrated with social networks, allowing users posting all their rides from Facebook in seconds after the completion. Peloton patents, as you have seen on the pictures from one of the patents, are describing methods or systems that combine home fitness equipment into the social network of the users. Number of some patents are also under this video. So if you want to compare the claims, our video watchers can use patent claim deconstruction methodology known in trees and it was developed by Boris Lotin from Ideation International. But since I have no legal education, I'm going to wait for the core decision about this IP conflict. And I will be glad to inform you about the outcome of this process. If you like our videos, like and subscribe. Take care of yourself and your family. See you next time.